Okay, I'm back. Well, I uh, went out and I got this uh, water filtration system um, called a Water Drop Chubby. And uh, one of the reasons I did that is I did a video uh, a little while back um, in regards to uh, a humidifier that I had to clean. And um, the water I was putting in is from the tap at the house. And um, I realized all the mineral deposits at the bottom of it that I had to clean coming out of the tap. And I'm drinking from that tap. So I could imagine the mineral deposits and all the fun stuff that my kidneys and my liver and all that has to uh, filter out. So I decided maybe I'll invest in one of these things here. So I got this thing called the Water Drop Chubby. Okay, now this particular model here, you're looking, it uh, does uh, 10 cups. Uh, each, pit each picture will uh, give you uh, 10 cups. And let's take a look at this here. Um, it provides great tastes, tasting filter water, uh, tea and coffee. Oh, that's great uh, for the family. It helps your family members stay healthy and reduces plastic waste in the world. So it has a lot of things it claims, but we'll <laughs> open this up and see what um, is inside. This is an unboxing of the uh, Water Drop Chubby. So we'll take a look and see what's doing in the box. Okay, so let's do an unboxing. I got the uh, little uh, cutter here. And let's find a little spot here to cut. Right in here like so. Let's cut this open. Get the plastic off. Okay. All right. Is this going to save all the plastic bottles in the world and keep my family healthy and all that fun stuff? Okay. Like so. Okay, so the first thing we see is the uh, owner's manual. Okay. And, uh, you know, explaining how everything works. And we'll go through all uh, that. Uh, I'll do it for you. You don't have to uh, do it. And, um, yep. Find the owner's manual and a little bit of foam action there. Okay, put the blade over here so I don't cut myself. And let's pull the whole thing out. So everything's out. So we'll put this like so, put it on the ground so we have space. And this is it here. So let's uh, take this baby out. Got the nice little seal. It's got a wooden handle here for cosmetics, I guess. And uh, let's uh, pop this open here. Oh, oh, that's the uh, front portion of the lid there. So that's where your water and stuff comes out. Okay. And uh, let's see how we take this out. First time doing this, so I'm hoping I'm not going to destroy anything. Okay, so the top piece is off. So you got that lid there. And a little piece of cardboard goes there. And right in here. Okay, let's see middle portion and in here is a filter okay let's see how we get this out here okay it's a little snug but the filter is out okay so that's your filter i don't want to touch anything with the filter there and this is your main your middle basket here that the filter snugs into okay when you take the plastic off the filter you snug that in there and away we go so i'm going to show you how everything works this is the unboxing part I don't want to touch anything there, and uh, we shall uh, go from there. So, I hope that was helpful. Okay, so let's start. It says step one, basically wash your hands. I wash my hands and I also put some little uh, middies on here, okay? And uh, then you want to take this filter here, take it out of the plastic, like so. Come out of the plastic, nice and easy, come on. Okay, filter is almost out. Okay, put this away. Okay, and it says to take the filter and put it in cold water until it's submerged. So you get the bubbles out. I'm hoping this works. Maybe. No, I won't do that. So let's do this. I don't know if the filter will work in this, but we'll find out. Okay, now we're going to submerge this baby, supposedly until all the bubbles come out. I can see bubbles coming out. Submerge. Come on, get all the bubbles out. 
I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm in a bubble removing operation right now. So I, lots of bubbles coming out. It's almost out. Okay. Seems to be sitting down there nicely. Good. So it's submerged. Okay. So all the bubbles are out and it's supposed to stay in here for uh, 10 minutes. So we'll put this out of the way. Now, this little puppy here, we're going to clean this. Okay. So we'll start on that right now. Okay, so now we're going to have to hand wash, it says, this picture on lid and the middle piece, okay, uh, with a mild detergent. So, we'll start this off like so. This, I guess, would be the mild detergent. Just a little drop of rooting. And let's start cleaning her up. Okay, get everything out of there. Yep. Get it nice and clean. Okay. That's done. I'll put it away. And now the same, same thing here. Just a little drop of rain. Whoop. The lid. Hmm. Interesting. It's gotta be clean. Okay. okay, that's done there, the inside, reduce that a bit, okay, okay, that, everything gets a little cleaning, okay, that's the lid, so that's done, I'm going to dry these off in a second. And of course the pitcher. Just a touch of just a mild detergent. Get it in there. So I'm not gonna bore you with this part here, but I wanna clean this baby up and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so we're all ready now. So we're gonna put the uh, middle piece in. Okay. Now they uh, say you cannot put this in the uh, dishwasher, so it has to be always hand cleaned, okay? And over here the filter has been uh, soaking for 10 minutes. So we'll put the filter in nice and snug, they say, nice and snug. Okay, that seems to be snug, okay. And uh, before I put the top on, uh, I'm supposed to put cold water in here, let it fill up, and then pour it out, and then do that twice, so that we can get everything activated and going and so on and so forth. So I'll do that right now, cold water. And right there, you can see it filling up in the bottom. It fills up pretty quick. Right there. So I'm going to fill this up, pour it out, fill it up again, pour it out, and then we're ready to go. I'll put the lid on and I'll show you how the light uh, indicator works. So I'm not going to bore you and let you watch this fill up. I'll get back to you as soon as it's done. Okay, so uh, there's one other thing I forgot to uh, mention. Right where the filter is, it's a little tab you have to remove. It says, please remove before use. <laughs> so I don't know if you saw that, but there's two of them. I'll, try, I'll do it again. This one's a little tougher. This one's really welded on there. Okay. And there we go. Pull the tab right off. So these two little tabs have to come off before you uh, get this going. Okay, so I filled this up through the filter, poured water in there and it filled up and I poured it out. I did that twice. Okay, so now everything's ready to go. The filter's ready to go. This is your lid at the bottom of the lid here. See the indicator light? This is the indicator light little system right here. There's two clamps. You gotta really squeeze hard to pop it out but there's really no battery. Once this goes, you have to replace the whole unit, okay? And um, 
Let's put this on like so. Bang. Okay. Now, once you uh, get everything all set, you press the button here for three seconds. And a blue light comes on and flashes. And that tells you that the filter is still clean. If it flashes red, you got about 10 days or so. If it's just red only, you got to replace the filter. Okay, so that's how that's done. So each time that you replace water in here, you're supposed to press that to see if it's uh, good to go. If you don't have this, just go by three months. Every three months you replace the filter. Or 200 gallons if you can uh, measure that. So anyways, I am going to uh, fill this up a bit more and uh, I'm going to have my first drink and let you see what uh, I think after having my first sip of water from my tap through a filter and we'll go from there. All right, so this is a pitcher, this is a cup. Let's pour it in and do the first taste test. Here we go. Just like what it's supposed to taste like, no taste. Mmm, this is not bad. I mean, uh, I'm so used to the chlorine and all the stuff that's coming out of the old tap there. But anyways, that's how water's supposed to taste. You're not supposed to really taste anything. It's just supposed to be nice and cold and go right through you. So hopefully uh, this uh, lasts and uh, I'll um, make more vids when I uh, get a chance.